you understand that if a man cheats, even if he wants 10 more girls after his marriage crumbles, you will still find 10 more girls that will be willing to marry him. Yeah. Women feel that if they cheat back, you know, it gets to hurt the partner, to be, the partner gets to feel what I, I feel. So, that's, I, I, first of all, if you have to cheat, don't be fat. <laughs> running to hell because her husband caught her pants <laughs> down cheating and it brings us and asking Cheetos should a married woman cheat and what should be her reason to cheat so just join us here i promise you it's gonna be fun now baby girl 
You see, first of all, yeah. I need to compliment you. Girl, you look. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. Thank you. And you look super, yes, super how we gorgeous. Do it. By the way, I it. love the shoes. They're amazing. Yes, girl. And you really got hot legs. Yes, yes, yes. I you know, I, I wish my legs were as hot as yours, you know. No, don't, don't go there. I, 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 know, I do really but admire the legs and the shoes. You know, I'm crazy about shoes. Let's not talk about shoes too much because right now we are going away from the topic. Oh, it's true. Don't mind me. Anyway, guys, so um, I've been I've been thinking since yesterday I saw this. I I didn't know you've seen this way back. Ah, uh, last week. Do you think as let's not look at this. Let's look at us as Africans now. In the past, we look at our mothers. These were faithful women, even when their husbands don't get to give them anything, they still carried the home and they didn't cheat. Not for a single day. But why is it so common now? And you know, the, the, the thing is that, I don't know, there's this African tradition in some places where you are not even allowed to cheat as a married woman. But we find out that these days, it seems it doesn't play out. Now, what could be the reason no, for this? It does. It does. Are you sure? Girl, it does. Because if it does, they won't be cheating this like this. No, no, I don't no. Think the so. thing is this. Um, the society we live in okay. has started normalizing some abnormal stuff. Okay. Do you get like when before in the past when you hear a, a woman cheat it's more like a taboo like what's going on why should you cheat like it, you, it's unheard of yes right now it's becoming a norm why because of the onset of social media and a lot of stuff going on so most times in the past women bottle up and hold a lot in okay. and try to say oh what would the society think of me if i do some certain things Right now, they don't give up. They don't give a BS. That's it. They don't. They don't. They don't care. Okay. And there is no rationale behind cheating. To what end? Why are you cheating? Then for you to cheat, I'd rather you walk away. Do you know, I I I get to think uh, because I've really heard people Someone say. Someone said you cheat. I cheat. Uh uh. No. <laughs> no. <laughs> yes. No. They say two no. Never makes it right. But do you know some women feel that if they cheat back? You know, it gets to hurt the partner. To the, the partner gets to feel what I they feel. So, no, no. You think no. it doesn't help? No, it doesn't, it doesn't help. It doesn't help. You can never two wrongs can never make a right. I, I, I'm not saying, uh, you know, um, but don't don't cheat because don't cheat at all. More so, don't cheat because your part your partner or your man is cheating. If you cannot take it, walk away honorably. <laughs> Because the way it will, the way it will sound and will look, or the scene that will be out there when the man cheats, will be just a tip of the iceberg compared to what, how loud to be when the woman or the you get. Yes, and, and imagine that woman running. Uh uh. You know, it, 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 it didn't really no, make any no, sense. Uh, that was no, really, no. that was quite embarrassing. It's and I embarrassing found... on every level. Trust me. Yes, but this women. I still ask because I try so hard to wrap my head around it. I've had, you know, one on one conversation with some friends, and of course, they will still tell you that they want to do this thing because they want to have their own pound of flesh. Okay, in your opinion, do you think it works? No, I, to me, it doesn't work because it doesn't change anything. Personally, if you cheat on me, I'm going to think about it, I'm going to feel worried, but it has never crossed my mind and i know it will never cross my mind to want to cheat back but i i am in my own opinion i feel it should not even make you feel better and before you know if you've not done this before you keep sinking into it you keep yes. doing it and then you think it's normal and you know the funniest part people now feel because um the white folks they do these things then they what? feel it's now okay Black. you know most Black times if people do the things that you do then you are uh, for a brother, they do a more. If you go out there, you go put the door, put the door. So they now want to bring that thing into Africa here. And they seem to, but they seem to forget that we are Africans. We have a damn culture. We have a culture. We have a culture. I, I, outside that, don't cheat because someone is cheating. That's, first of all, the person is controlling you, controlling your emotions, controlling your actions, controlling you directly and indirectly. You don't have, want to have a control. You are, you are so much and more when you tell yourself you know what if you cheat on me then you don't deserve me i'm i'm a walk away and then you walk away walk out of the relationship so that would be better than cheating 
because it's not in your nature, especially when it's not in your nature. Yes, to change, change. And then you're now trying so hard. What are you trying to impress? And, you know, what end? You are, in other words, you you're saying, saying, gold. It, it could make you want to cheat before you, know, you, you find yourself, you know, sinking into it and you will exactly. not see it as a norm. So yeah. in other words, why? So it's going to be part of you, you not know, just try to say you won't do one. Because no be you. Exactly. And this is what we are saying. We don't want to go into the topic of um, getting married to the wrong person, but or being in the wrong relationship. But one of the reasons why people cheat is because you're entangled in the wrong thing. And you, you entered into the thing because because of something. Not because you really want this and this is your focus and this is what you want. And then when you when you're not getting another part of part of it, probably you entered the marriage because the guy has money. And uh, the bad matters. It's not good. It's not mathematic. Yes. <laughs> yes, I've heard of reasons like that. You you get? Know? Yes, some girls will be like, okay, let's try those materialistic ones. They'll say, okay, uh, since there's money, I'm after the money first. I think exactly. that's the other one. And then you'll find that the other one will not be sorted. The bad exactly. Yeah. Yes. And then you cheat. It means you married for some reason. You didn't marry for the holistic reason. reason. And you cheat. And that's quite bad. That's quite bad. I exactly. Is it that you then you, another you thing is have everything? You know you were in the relationship you were calling. Why you were calling? You knew that this guy had tendencies of being promiscuous. Sure. And you decided, oh, someday, somehow you, you deceived yourself in your head somewhere. You told yourself, Oh, when we get married, I'm gonna change him. Hey, hey, nah, uh -uh. Oh, he drinks, but don't worry. I'm sure he's going Good. to quit as soon as we Now you're married, he's doing it, and you can't take it no more. Girl, you wouldn't have taken it from the job. You would have walked away. That's what I think. The question is, will ladies ever walk away? Yes, yes, yes. I'm, even, see, I'm more particular. I, yes, I, yes. I don't yes. justify, you know, I'm not in the league of people. I don't support people that cheat and stuff, but I'm, I'm more particular about this married women. It's quite embarrassing. Uh, now I'm beginning to feel that maybe we don't even have all this culture or some kind of tradition that bounds us. If you go to South East, people have these things. Most married women, you don't death. Ah, uh -huh, uh -huh, South East. Ah, uh ah, -huh, uh -huh. even my No, 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 no. You would have said no. No, it's not. No, <laughs> South East. No, uh -huh. so that's no. where cheating is. South cheating East, is South East. South East. Southwest. They North cheat. North is that what you wanted to say? No, they all they cheat. They cheat. They cheat, most of them, not all. Not all, no, 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 I, I'm sorry, guys. Guy. No. Most of them, we're not saying Some all. of them cheat. But where I'm, the, the, I'm the rate that they cheat over there is, is more than half. Because the northern people have this very strict culture. Do they have? Do they? Because why call South? Uh, First South of all, as a Hausa person, because I know you, know, you cannot use South. South as, as a Hausa person, you can't there. I grew but up why in the But why do they still cheat? Now the cheating there, you see, cheating is is the cheating there. This, all this the culture, is, they cheat there everywhere. You cheat, but the, the rate at which they cheat there is minimal compared to the south east south south. Uh, you know why why I talk about south south east because I know that we do have some kind of you know tradition tradition that people are not living by tradition. That's the thing. But Let me thing tell is, you, it's not cheating thing is a personal to... thing, right? Because whether you like it or not. A lot of pressure will be on you by whatever is going on as things evolve to do certain to live certain life lifestyles or do something against the status quo. But that doesn't mean you should do it. Now it's more like a personal thing that you tell yourself no matter what is going on, there are some certain things I cannot do. This is where I draw the line. And that's why I said that for you to cheat, I would rather say, you know what, I'm done with this. I can't can bust some damn grapes, so I can't engage myself in the food fight. You know, if you actually you know, have a uh, uh, conversation with some girls right now, who chose us who would like you guys to drop, oh, God, drop it in the comment section? Let's know what's your take about this cheating thing and more particularly about this married women that we are Okay, now about. let's let's keep the married part of it. Okay. Let's come to the single Pringles. Okay. Do you think uh, a lady in a relationship should cheat? No, I'm not in support of that. I don't think so. I don't in fact I cannot advise a lady 
in a serious relationship to cheat. Okay. Yes, I I cannot. I, I it's not wise. Some of so okay, okay. okay. reason. What do what I answer would you give is, some people? This uh, uh group of people that will say ah she's not married, so um she's still in the market. She's still in the market so uh, um. You are still in the market. You not be Kezaya now. You <laughs> never. You can't be. No, oh you can't God. be. You can't be Kezaya. You can't be in a relationship. You say you're in a serious relationship, and then you are jumping from one man to another. You have to stick to one. You know why? Somebody said a friend of mine once said that. Okay, some people do this thing so that. Uh, the heartbreak will be less in case uh, maybe the okay, heartbreak break break your heart. Yeah. Okay, you just hold on oh to my God. Be. You won't lose. You will run out okay, to, 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 to. It still to, doesn't make any sense. And I've B. asked this question Is it that you are keeping Mr. A doing the bed match with Mr. A and you're not doing with Mr. B? And Mr. B is cool with it because I don't understand. If you are no, they don't know. Of course, they don't know. You won't be cheating and want all of them know. to know that you're now cheating. Now your body will they talk so. Now your body. Is your body you are giving? Exactly. Are you not giving A and B? And we, you know, we have some guys like giving A, B, C, D, E, F, and G, e. H to the twenty-six. And then you will say you are not doing hook up. You love your no show. So what are what you doing? You will say I want to get married. What's going on? You are not serious with anyone. What is your problem? You know what? You know the, the, the thing they find. The funniest. The, the, the one thing about this thing is that eh, you feel that. Some girls feel okay. This is wisdom for me to keep them, so that if A breaks my heart, I will hold on to B. You know, at least I see how B can hold on to. B. But then, before you know, that's, you that's, find that they're not holding anyone. That's their insecurity speaking, and it's so loud, louder than a boom mic. That's their insecurity speaking. Because the truth is this: if you know who you are, if you know your worth, yes. You would know that there is a right person for you, mm-hmm. and you won't fall into just any hands. And it it brings us back to what I said initially: that you're doing this because there's something you're pursuing. So you saw something. Probably the guy has money, and you said, "Oh, I'm going for his money." And then the his character, um, his character, and his, nothing to write him about. It's just not there. And then you hold on to be that he's a uh, poor or but. Has got good character and he's more caring. Uh-huh. Oh, you get so if you want to be in it, be in it, and then if you don't just jump into a relationship because you want to jump into a relationship. Now we are listening. Uh, what we are doing is talking about reasons why people cheat. So whatever we are doing is still boiled down to don't just rush because you want to rush into a relationship. Or you feel lonely, you feel there's a need to have somebody. Let me tell you, I will give you a succinct view on this thing, and this is it. A girl knows when a guy truly loves her. What? Yes. There are signs? Yes. You can tell. You can tell when a guy truly cares about you. Even when he doesn't like expresses. You know some expresses, uh, express it. There are some ladies that feel like, um, okay, you have to So if you're jumping me. into a relationship, ah, uh, because of... Don't tell me that ah, I didn't know. I didn't know, so uh, I'm not sure. If you know someone that will be with you, you know. So you don't have to have a Mr. B or Mr. C or Mr. D because you're quite sure. You're not one hundred percent sure, but there is an assurance somewhere there that this person there is prospect. So if you're jumping to B and C and D because you said there is no prospect, and if you have to jump to B and D and C. Can you please step out of that relationship? So you don't look like I don't I don't how do people do it? No, I don't I'm not, know. I'm, I don't know how they keep up because sometimes I ask myself the lies, the lies, the lies. If A calls and you're on the phone with A and then B calls, or you're in the house of A and then B calls, you, you what become will you, you become do? the the, 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 the one that gets me the when you're in in a hotel room with a married man and you, his wife calls. We tell you, then you are. No, I, I mean, <laughs> that's really embarrassing. I mean, I don't even want to see myself in this kind of situation. I don't like, even want stress. No, and what the H? You, you are so yesterday. I was really what is it? Because I, you, I you didn't see the right. other one. Okay, mean? let me let me give you the details of that. You know, I'm here to spill the tea, guys. So, apparently. Um, the way the video started, uh, there was a back and forth. Obviously, the wife had gone out 
okay. or gone to work or traveled and for some reason whatsoever she came and the husband was with a side chick and she caught them she now she was downstairs and this is like more like this mini estate and stuff so uh, i think a two-story building or something so she was like calm down the, the wife was downstairs calm. Are we, are we, so the, as the wife is trying to go go into the, you know, there's a uh, staircase you have to climb before you yeah. go. The lady will be trying to, she was not, she was wrapped with a towel. The lady will be trying to jump from the damn balcony. Are you? I mean, yeah. Oh, so if you jump from the balcony, first of all, the towel will leave your body. Then your booty will be everywhere, all over the place. There's a very high tendency you enjoy yourself because you're not really? athletic in the first place. No, even if you're athletic. For a lady. And before you get up, the lady would have come for you. So, it was just wrong on every level of it. I don't know how it ended though, but the neighbors started coming out because the, the thing was getting really loud too. And see, the lady was confused. She was, she was, should I jump? Or she what should I, she, the man stood there, he didn't know what to do. At the end of the day, this is what I think about she. It tells more, it's more negative on the lady ladies than the men. Because trust me, there's a way the man will go about it, the, the woman will forgive him. But now the lady has given herself a stigma because for crying out loud, you're on social media. And Tomorrow she'll want to veer for a position and then one thing with social media, it doesn't lie. They don't forget. They don't forget. They will dig up the video. Thank you, girl. Maybe this lady uh, yeah, went up from back on them. <laughs> You know what I see? Ah. Where I told well. you. You know how you know how it is here in Nigeria. Ah, that lady that was wearing a a a, 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 a pants suit the other day and was running to hell. Yes. I hold on for her. So you know it doesn't really care well, like you say. If you want to cheat, make sure you're not fast. Because if you see the she, she looks like a, a confused elephant running to and fro. She looks like my God. People, bang 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 bang. Ah ah. Hey. For me, okay, for me, down. I will still say, whatever it is we are doing, we should bear in mind that we are Africans. It's not everything the white folks do that we have to adopt. Even in the Our even mothers, in the Western they world, they, the Western don't world, they don't want. Yes, they don't. Yes. They can literally hurt you because you cheated on them. Yes. yes. So they don't. Can't. Cheating is cheating everywhere. Don't cheat. Period. Yes. There is no justification. I don't know. I don't know. But if you know, if you have to if cheat, you know step you away from the woman, Please, please. I think it's embarrassing. From the scene you guys saw, it's really embarrassing, and it shouldn't even play out. I felt embarrassed myself. On her even behalf, though not me what, is she to, what is she going to tell her husband? She got rich house. <laughs> <laughs> if now you got rich house, she never rich house. That husband don't look like who go use hot water for you. No, 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 be out. no husband no be there. The husband brother. Yeah, but, but the husband not see everything finished now. So to wait a video. Hey, God, oh. <laughs> see, <laughs> from that place, eh? She should just take her things, just carry the bag and the clothes she's putting on straight up. So now, her house. This, it brings me to ask you this question. Do you think, in your honest opinion, do you think that um, um, the same measure of treatment given to a man that um, cheats should be the same measure of treatment given to a woman? So should it be same? Should there be equilibrium? Because um, it's more like, oh, when a man cheats, it's like, Okay, you know what? It's a man. Um, yeah, it's a he can actually pass. What pass it? No. And a woman cheats. It's like ooh, ooh. And for the man, be you a man, be a woman. He don't cheat. But what I'm saying is, eh, we know where we are. We know we are Africans. I still keep saying this thing. Now here is more like they've seen it like it's a norm for a man to cheat, even though I don't think it's right, and I feel it's not right. Mm -hmm. But you understand that if a man cheats, even if he wants 10 more girls after his marriage crumbles, you will still find 10 more girls that will be willing to marry him. Yeah. But for the lady that cheats, and then you divorce on the account that you cheat, you will find out that maybe somebody else, you know, indicates interest in settling down with you again, and then somehow somewhere mm -hmm. if the video even if the video doesn't go viral mm -hmm. there's this thing about you know karma i don't know how to put it mm -hmm. but one or two persons from the uh, a cli a league of a, a clique of friends or league of friends that uh, with the new person you are with mm -hmm. you might just know you're like, ah, that lady 
this is what happened. Or somewhere. Yeah, it actually out. brings me to it a video. It destroys the I lady saw a video. alone. Yes, I saw that a video. That is where I'm coming from. Okay, I saw a video of, um, but this one, uh, I wouldn't say she cheated because I saw a video of a guy okay, telling a lady, you know what, I'm done with you. This was one. Um, uh, she had a one night stand with his friend. Oh, now, but she hold didn't on, know, right? Hold on, before meeting him. Okay. Now, she had that one night stand, and somewhere down the line, the friend um, left the country, went outside. <laughs> this was about coming back. Now, she eventually knew that, okay, this person I'm dating is a friend of someone I had a one, and these are very close friends, someone I had a one night stand with, right? And then she now said, you know what, I need to open up to my guy so that he's not taking her back. Um, so the friend won't come back and tell him, okay, this is what happened between me and your girl. So let him hear it from me first time. And she told him, and he lost it. And he said, you know what, I can't do with you anymore. And he had plans to actually settle down with her, but he said, I can't do with you anymore. No. I don't so think uh, what do you say about that? Is that cheating? Do you, it's not cheating. You can't call that cheating. It's not. That is not cheating. Mind you, she had the one night stand before she met the guy. Yes. And yes. if yeah, it's not Absolutely. a game, maybe long before she met the guy. So why would the guy want to hold that against, against her? her yeah. It makes no sense. So I just feel to me, maybe he doesn't really love her deep down enough. Yeah. So he then, doesn't. when you said... Uh, so how should we even be bold enough to tell you, okay, after discovering that this is my person, my guy's person, yeah. I should just open up. Mm -hmm. She tried to sell. She, she really want this to say. Do you know some ladies will not say anything? And when the guy comes? They won't say anything. And the, when the guy be, comes? When the guy comes? Uh-huh. <laughs> they will not say anything. Then your guy will hear it from his The other guy, guy may not even want to say anything. Because his past, did they really date? No but idea. They didn't. It was a one night thing. And I'm sure something must have happened for that one night stand to have taken place. I don't know. And so, what I'm saying, whether something happened or something did not happen, I don't think is a good enough reason for you to want to dump somebody that you say you love. In the past, this, this is, this, that was, that was a past. If they say, yes, we all have our past. Mm -hmm. So he didn't, he didn't love her enough, that's what You I can think. hold me accountable or do anything you want to do if I do it after I meet you. You can do anything you want to do. If I meet you and I go ahead, you know, to continue doing what I, what I was doing before, what I did before with your friend, mm -hmm. then you can do anything you want to do. But this is somebody's past. We all have our past. Mm -hmm. We all have. People turn new leaves. So there are things that you shouldn't hold against the person. Mm -hmm. Things you shouldn't hold against the totally person. agree. So if a lady can forgive a man, you know, that did yes. a lot of reckless thing in the past yeah. and still want to settle with a person. He's not so insane. why can't you a guy forgive the lady? Yes. Yes. And um do you think another thing is do you think like um let's bring the married woman that cheated? Huh? Um do you think her husband should forgive her and accept her and move on? You know? Do you think so? Um, or do you think he should, he should be like, you know what? You cheated and it's, it's, uh -uh, it's not forgivable. Leave my house. I'm done. What do you think? I, I can't say because um, I, I'm not in the man's shoes. They say he wears his shoes. But do you, do you think but it's something that should be forgivable? But I, I think he should. I think he should forgive her. Especially though... Uh, Trust once broken is very difficult to build up again. But like um, yes, but I think um, with uh, a good, um, should I say, counseling and all that, you know, both of them should be able to get back. You know, mend that broken relationship, mend that broken trust, and then pick up from where they start. There is every guarantee that she will never repeat this kind of thing again. Because even the guy said, the guy, the woman, the husband, if you check very well, he said they cheat. If you go and do your research very well, he's no sense. He's no sense. So he should and also forgive. But what is why the guarantee? She cheated. What is the guarantee that he didn't cheat before she, before she carried her bags to say, let me go and cheat her? Well. Yeah. But there's every yeah. probability. Yeah, there's every yeah, chance actually. that he did the same thing. But I'm not justifying what she did, though, guys. 
I know they don't say because your husband cheats. Don't cheat because, because someone cheated. cheated. You go cheat. Walk away honorably. That's what I think. Yes. If you have to, if it hurts so bad and you think you can't take it no more, get out of the kitchen. Keep it moving. Keep it moving, guys. So that you just save yourself. So you don't say mental and uh, you know stress and the stress. aftermath of it. Because one thing with this thing is a lot of people don't think before acting. If you think yeah. and weigh all the options, then you see reasons why you should just let it go. I yes. say, you know what, I'm done. Then if you if you married him because of financial security or whatever it is, and he's cheating, please understand that you decided to get into that. Money fully you well. bargained for it. That was what you wanted. So don't cheat because he's cheating, because you married him for some reason. Particularly. Yes, so. Yes. So just stay there for that reason. Enjoy it. And be faithful. If the reason if the reason eventually cuts off, you are married, stay there. Stay Next there. time. <laughs> you consider. Oh my god! Where are your options? Oh my god! Oh my god! The pros and cons before getting into anything. Yeah, 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 people. Yes, so guys, oh. it's really nice having you here with yeah. us. Please remember to drop your opinion. Drop your comment in the comment section. Tell yes, us what so you think. think about my if you have other um um videos of or if you want us to talk about any topic that is biting you somewhere. And give 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 you if you want us to give you our honest truth, then please let us know. Yes. Let so. us know. And again, guys, um, so we don't only talk about what is going on, we also match make. So um if you want um to meet someone because you know you get to meet people everywhere. Everywhere. Yeah. Yes, yeah, so everywhere. Yes. I've heard of people that So we also match make if you want to meet someone on this platform, mm -hmm. just give us your specification. Yes, yeah, so So let me give you an example. Um you're a man and you want to meet a lady on this platform. Just tell us, oh, this is what I want. I want a, a tall lady, dark. Um, eloquent and whatever it is you want. want we will get someone that fits the bill get you two on the show so we can take it up from there mm -hmm. if it's a match yay we'll celebrate of course it's not a match we, that's why we're here we'll try again <laughs> that's why we're here that's girl. why we're here so we are here we'll be giving you all the teas and our truth Yes, so yes. And so I keep up with us. Happenings. Keep up with us. So very yes, important. Yes, very important. I had a nice time. And me too. Ooh, girl, it's really nice. You this know? is fun. Very fun. Yay. Really yes, so we'll be giving you the tips. Don't worry. We and got you. Kosi and Rina got you. Yes, so guys, we got you. It's so nice having you here. So is it a wrap? It's a wrap, girl. All right, so guys, guys. We'll see you some other time. Like, share, subscribe, turn on your notifications so each time we post, you get to see it. Yes, so very important. We remain yours truly, cozy and. Rita. All right, have a good day. Bye bye. Bye.